the Pentagon is on verge of a decision that could reshape the US Navy's carrier-based aviation for decades. After months of delays, the Defense Department is expected this week to select a defense contractor to design and build the Navy's next stealth fighter, the FAXX, a program positioned at the heart of US efforts to counter China's growing air power. Boeing and Northrop Grumman remains in contention, with the winner set to undertake a multi-billion dollar project that will define naval aviation well into the 2030s. FAXX is intended to replace the aging FA-18 Super Hornet fleet, which has served the Navy since the 1990s. Its development has been slowed by funding debates and competing demands on contractors' resources. Some Pentagon officials feared Boeing might struggle to supply enough engineers after its award of the Air Force F-47 program, while Northrop's Senatal ICBM work has already pushed program costs upward. Congress, however, has reinforced the program's momentum by embarking $750 billion US dollar to accelerate initial development and additional $1.4 billion for physical 2026. Unlike the current F-35C Lightning II, which forms the backbone of carrier air power today, the FAX-6 promises capabilities tailored for high-end threats of the 2030s. F-35C, manufactured by Lockheed Martin, is a fifth-generation stealth fighter the maximum speed of Mach 1.6, a combat radius exceeding 600 nautical miles, and a weapons payload of up to 18,000 pounds. Its carrier compatibility, advanced sensors, and interoperability with Allied forces make it central to present naval operations. Yet, analysts note its limitation in range and payload compared to what the Navy anticipates from the next generation fighter. The FAX is in contrast with design with a 25% greater range and combat radius than the F-18F, enhanced stealth technology and the ability to carry advanced munition. It is expected to operate in optionally manned configuration and integrate with ungrewed combat aircraft, reflecting a shift toward man-unmanned teaming. While exact specification remain classified, the aircraft represents a generational leap, signaling the Navy's intent to maintain technological edge over China, which has been rapidly advancing both fifth and sixth generation aircraft prototypes. A prolonged lag could leave the Navy relying on an increasingly obsolete Super Hornet fleet and a finite number of F-35Cs. With China's growing naval and aided capabilities, the timing of this selection is crucial. The Navy plans to continue operating more than 270 F-35C aircraft alongside the Super Hornets fell into the 2040s. FAXS will not simply replace these assets but complement them, forming a layered, technologically advanced carrier air wing capable of confronting peer adversaries. Its selection is thus both a programmatic decision and a signal of US intent to maintain air dominance in contested waters.